The Beijing based Galactic Energy has become the first commercial space company in China to launch a satellite from the sea using technologies never before attempted that could boost China's space launch capabilities. The company's Ceres 1 solid fuel rocket lifted off from a mobile platform off the coast of eastern China's Shandong province on Tuesday, sending four satellites into an orbit about 800 km above Earth to form part of an Internet of Things constellation. The 20-meter-long, 1.4-meter-wide Ceres-1 can deliver 400 kg into low Earth orbit. Tuesday's launch carried Tianqi satellites 21 to 24. Once the 38th satellite constellation is completed next year, it will provide a wide range of data services to civilian and military customers alike, such as marine communications, ecological monitoring, smart city building and battlefield situation awareness. While previous sea launches involved a launch tube or rack mounted on the floating platform to hold the rocket, Ceres-1 took off from a transport erector launcher which was driven onto and fixed to the barge. The company says that this is the world's first hot launch on a land transport launch vehicle at sea. The launch vehicle was fixed on the ship with a magnesium strip locking mechanism added to the tail end of the rocket. The structure was simple, easy to operate and required low ground support conditions. Before ignition, the magnesium strip locking mechanism ensured the vertical safety of the rocket under shaking conditions. After ignition, it could be removed and unlocked for a reliable takeoff. It is the world's first solid rocket locking and release mechanism that does not use explosives. There are several major advantages to sea launches. Repositioning boat or barge to launch in many locations provides flexibility and can help launch to different orbital inclinations. Launching at sea can also be safer than launching on land as the launch pad can be positioned far from populated areas and away from busy airspace and shipping lanes.